the Echo Slam. Oh, there it is. Forward. There's your slam. There's the dunk. Hello. Gamer Nom is back. So last week we did the quick fruit, right? Now, for the flame fruit lovers out there, it is your time. So for this King's Legacy video, we're going to do the level 1 noob reaches second C using flame fruit. Okay guys, so for our first skill, the flame fist. But we're not gonna use it yet. We're gonna do a special quest, which is the snake quest. First, we need to eat chicken first. That's my favorite to level up fast. For those saying guys that uh, you need to do this until you reach level 20, don't do that guys. That's not true. Okay, so first here are the locations. There you go, the spawn point, the black market, and the front of the manor. There you go guys. You're gonna do this until you reach level 11. So, gamer, how many times do I need to do that? I think 4, 7, 9, 11, yeah. You need to do it 4 times. There you go. Don't forget to put all your stats in the power fruit. Okay, so now when you reach level 11, you are ready to defeat the clown pirates. Well, how do you lure the clown pirates? Guys, it's easy. We're a logia type fruit user, so they won't be able to damage you when you reach level 11. Okay, so I'm gonna show it to you. Let's make this fast. See that, guys? Punch, dodge. Dodge, we're just using the dodge to like uh, move faster, okay? See that? No problem, easy. Lure 4, use your flame fist. There you go. And that's it. You're gonna do this until you reach level 13. And at level 13, you will be unlocking something. Yes, our next skill, which is the Inferno Pillar. There you go. So guys, this skill is a short range. So still, you need to lure them. But guys, again, for me, this is one of the fastest fruit to level up. I'm telling you guys. Okay, so I'm gonna show it to you in this video. But you need to reach level 21st. Okay, there you go. Put all your stats in the power fruit and you can now start defeating Smokey. Check that out guys. Too early in the game and they're trying to bully me. <laughs> okay, regarding stats, I allotted 4 points in the first island, okay? Just to increase my HP. Okay, there you go. Two skills to defeat Smokey, and when you reach level 30, we can now start defeating Tashi. Guys, even with this mob, level 30, we can defeat it with two skills. It shows how powerful this fruit is. Boom, see that guys. Okay, so now when you reach level 38, okay, let's reach level 38. We will be unlocking another skill. And this skill is very strong if you can use this in PvP or in mobs the firefly guys this is kind of slow but very strong see that guys one hit you can one hit tashi now leveling up will be a lot faster oops I forgot to dodge that okay guys so now 42 i forgot to show you the flame fly actually you will be unlocking that earlier but i wasn't able to notice it check that out faster than magma but slower than light so in the middle same with i think the gum fruit Okay, so let's level up until we reach level 50. Okay. Oh, someone's attacking us again, but you cannot yet. Level 50, okay, we'll be vulnerable to attackers. Now let's run fast and head to the next village, which is the Pirate Island. Oh, okay, sorry, Pirate Island. So we're gonna start here by defeating five clown pirates. Easy, easy job, guys. Okay, don't forget to buy the sorrow when you got like five. 50k belly. So first skill, I know, don't sorry, the Inferno Pillar, Firefly, and Flame Fist. Guys, the cooldown of these skills are very fast. Okay, there you go. That's one whole quest. You're gonna do this until you reach level 75. Okay, 75. There you go. And after that, you will move on to Buggy the Clown. Guys, at 75, I think, or 76, it should be 75. Again, I uh, allotted some points in the defense because. Uh, at first, you need to like tank some of the damages, right? Okay, so at 76, we'll be unlocking all the skills. V skill, the Fire Emperor. Guys, I love this skill because the cast time is so fast. See that? See that? That's so cool, guys. Now, you just need to time the fire fly properly. Okay, so defeat this clown really, really fast. But we're gonna level up here until we reach level 100, okay? Okay. Guys, I suggest you always use the Firefly first before using other skills. 
You need to aim it properly. So for the next island, we have the Soldier Island. So we're gonna start here by defeating six commanders. So how do you do it fast, gamer? No, check this out. Flame Fist, Firefly. Use your Fire Emperor. Okay, see that? Oh, I missed one. Oh, okay. Now two more. You're gonna use your Firefly and your Flame Fist. Okay. Game run on those kind of slow. Again, again, again. Sorry, sorry. I'll make it better. Flame Fist, Firefly, Blink, uh, Sorrow, sorry, Fire Emperor, Fire Fist, and use your Inferno Pillar. Okay? You're gonna do that until you reach level 120. Now, 120, guys, it's very easy to defeat the Captain. Just use, use all your skills if you want. Boom. Actually, you don't need the Fire Emperor. I'm just making it sure. Okay, so now after that guys, before it even spawns, you're gonna defeat 6 commanders. So that's 2 levels, I mean, oh yeah, that's 2 level ups, no second wasted. Huh? No second wasted, boom, okay. And you're gonna damage it, boom, and get the quest, there you go, and boom. Guys, you're gonna do this until you reach level 145, okay? After reaching 145, you think this is fast? Next leveling up technique will be a lot faster. Oops, oh, I saw that one coming. Anyway, 145, Axe Hand. So first, defeat Axe Hand. Use your Firefly and your Flame Fist. Now, fly or dodge towards the Captain. Use your Firefly and first skill. There you go. Just do this until you reach level 200. Gamer Nom, you're gonna skip again the quest in the... Of oh, what do you call this? The Shark Island? Yes, we're gonna skip that because again, uh, the Flame Fruit is good with single target enemies, but not so good with long uh, enemies that are so far apart. So, first, Karate Fishman. Okay, guys, check this out one combo. You're gonna defeat this 30 times. Why? Because after that, we will go to our next target. There you go, the Shark Man, guys. This area is one of the fastest area to level up, aside from Pasista, the Pacifista in the Bubble Island. See that, guys? And after that, it, the moment that it cooldowns, see that, guys? The Shark Man is alive again. You don't need to go to other areas to level up or defeat. And we are going to level up here until you reach level 300, okay? 300. We're gonna skip another quest again. Why? Because that quest needs you to lure bombs okay so here we are chef ship we're gonna start with the dark leg again guys one combo shout out to the dinosaur guys Let's check that out guys we're respecting each other we don't attack each other we're just farming okay, so when you reach level 350 you can now defeat two mobs okay so first the weapon man at 350 again and after defeating it go to the dark leg guys don't worry no second wasted here. We are gonna do this until you reach level 450. See that guys? Before it even spawns, we're back. So at 450, guys, uh, there's a mistake here. I should've uh, went to this island, the snow island at 500, but it's fine. So defeat the snow king until you reach 500. Why? Because in the chef ship, guys, you defeat two mobs, right? Faster compared to one. Okay, so now, at 500, you can start defeating the Heavy Man, go to Snow King, Heavy Man, Snow King, Heavy Man, Snow King, really, really fast, until you reach level 625. Before going to the Sand Village, go to Sky Island and buy the Observation Hockey. Okay, so now, Desert Island, defeat the Bomb Man until you reach 725. Okay, but Gamer, I think we will be having a hard time with this mob. The king of sand because it's far away and it can damage us no guys check this out well, make sure to put lots of uh, stats on your power foot okay at 725 we can one hit this use your v skill fire emperor and your flame fist boom and that's it guys see that do this until you reach level 800 guys and after that we can now proceed to our next island the sky island uh, after this, two more islands and we are good to go to the second sea. Okay, so at Sky Island, four Sky Soldiers. Very easy, fast spawn. Let's do this. 
use your V skill. Guys, you cannot hit three with one skill here, so you're gonna use three skills. There you go, Inferno Pillar, Flame Fist, and uh, Fire Emperor, and that's it, guys. Do this until you reach level 850. And after that, go up and start defeating the ball man. Guys, I saw someone training here, so I just add him as a friend. There you go, oh no, as a party member. And we level up, even though it made, um, made the leveling up slower for me, at least we help someone, right? There you go. So we are gonna do this until you reach level 900. Guys, if you're uh, wondering where is the Gumfruit user, he already uh, reached 1000 and tried to like, uh, what do you call this? Unlock his gear fourth. Congrats to him. So guys, you cannot hit this Rumble Man with your Flame Emperor, Fire Emperor. So use first skill to defeat him or use your first skill, go near. But make sure that it takes six times first because when you move within its range while the fire is taking, it will hit you, okay? So at 1000, you can go to Bubble Island and start defeating five soldiers. So how do you defeat them? First skill, okay, Firefly is your Fire Emperor. Guys, you can hit three enemies here with your Fire Emperor but sometimes I do miss. So at 1100, you can start defeating the leader. Gamer rooms, there a faster way. Yeah, defeat the leader and fly towards the soldiers. Boom. And after that, go back to the leader. Okay? Don't worry, the cooldown of your skills are fast. You're gonna do this until you reach level 1150. And now you can defeat the Pasista until level 1325. What? How about the wolf gamer gnome? Guys, I'm gonna show you why we're gonna stay here. Okay, we're gonna time it as a proof. So I went to the wolf, okay, so defeated one. Guys, we're timing it. I'm gonna show you. Guys, the spawn time of the wolf is so long. Check that out, okay. So it took me like 23, 24 seconds to defeat two wolves, okay? Two wolves. So now in Pasista, guys, check that out. That's first skill and V skill, okay? Again, first skill and V skill. And that's it, guys. We defeated three Pasistas in 24 seconds compared to two Wolves. So we're gonna stay there until we reach 1325. And when we reach there, we're gonna go to Lobby Island and defeat two mobs at the same time. See that guys? Two mobs, don't worry. The giraffe hasn't spawned yet, okay? So again, let's do this. We're gonna defeat the giraffe first, okay? Oh, giraffe. Use your wait, Firefly, there you go, and your Fire Emperor, it's dead. Boom. And then defeat the wolf, okay? So at 1,400, we're gonna start defeating the Leo. Gamernos, they're faster way, yes. After you defeat the Leo, go to the Giraffe, defeat it, and go back to the Leo, okay? So you're gonna do this until you reach level 500 and we're good to go. At 1-5, you can now go to the War Island. Why gamer? No. The mobs there are so strong. No. We're just gonna get the quest. The Traveler quest. There you go. It will ask you to go to Fishland and defeat a certain fishman. There you go. That's the guy. The dude. And after that, if you're lucky, you can get the map really, really fast. There you go. And you need to go back to War Island. Talk to the Traveler. And he will thank you. And we'll ask you to go to Starting Island and talk to the Elite Pirate. And after that, you can now go to the Second Sea. Alright guys, so that's it for this video. I hope that you enjoyed. Requests, just comment it on the comment section. Again, to all the supporters, I really appreciate you all. I hope that you learned something from this. Again, I'm accepting requests. To all the viewers, subscribers, supporters, I appreciate you all. This is GamerNom. And GamerNom out.